Hey everybody, this is Dr. David. I'm gonna do your manual therapy Thursday this week. We're gonna talk about knee internal external rotation mobilizations. Now you're probably thinking, what? The knee doesn't move like that. It does flexion and extension. There isn't much rotation that happens. Well, well there is. And if you think about the screw hole mechanism of the knee, which is when the knee extends all the way, it goes through a little bit of external rotation. If you have some external rotation in the knee, then you have to have some internal rotation. So let me show you how I check for it here. Bend up the knee just a bit, go ahead and bend the knee. There you go. What I do is I get on the joint line right here. So here's the, the femur, here's the tibia. So right here's the joint line. I'm just gonna palpate that. Then I'm down here at the ankle. I'm gonna rotate inwards and you have internal rotation. I can feel the tibia moving on the femur here. So I'm just gonna wiggle it here. Now if you got somebody with a knee, any kind of knee problem, whether it's meniscal, uh, ligamentous, um, you wanna check the internal rotation and the external rotation, then compare it to the other side, just like that, to see if there's a difference. And if you've got somebody with a, a knee issue, chances are you're gonna find a difference side to side. Where it's restricted, you wanna mobilize it. So this is how I check. Once I mobilize, what I'll do is I'll put my hand over right here to guide the tibia into internal rotation or external rotation. So if I'm gonna do internal rotation, I'll kind of hook around the, the tibial tuberosity here, grab the rest of the tibia immediately here, and force it into internal rotation. Now if I'm gonna go into lateral rota or external rotation, then I'll, I'll kind of readjust this position here so I can curl it in this way, and I'll, and I'll pull it over into external rotation that way. Very effective mobilization for improving the mechanics at the knee. I'm gonna put that down there. Guys, if you have any questions about this, or you wanna learn more, um, or if you've tried this on patients um, and you, you're confused about how to do it, just comment and let us know what problems you're having. I'm happy to help. Thanks, have a great day.